Hofstra University took part for the first time this year in National Public Health Week with a series of free events examining some of the most pressing challenges facing health professionals today. The series included film screenings, panel discussions, and interactive student-run exhibits that tackled topics including the public health impact of Superstorm Sandy and the shootings at Sandy Hook. This is the first year that we have an MPH program and it seemed like the perfect opportunity to really operationalize what we teach in the classroom, that the importance of getting the word out, the power of prevention is not just about knowledge but about doing and showing people how important it is to kind of work in partnership, to have conversations about really critical issues and so um, we have a very engaged student body and both the Master of Science at Community Health and the Public Health students were very interested in trying to get this series off the ground. Uh, this panel, which is uh, entitled uh, Mental Health Policy and Practice Issues in the Wake of Sandy uh, Hook, uh, is all about bringing the community together in uh, regards to addressing the issues that were raised from the tragedy uh, that occurred in Newtown, Connecticut. Um, the fact that it was brand new is precisely what brought me here. Um, it's something that's starting from scratch. It's something that has room to develop. And I wanted to be part of something like a group that was growing and changing and constantly like enveloping what's new. It's only our second semester, so something as huge as this on campus kind of promotes our program, promotes what we're doing, what you know our interests are. The entire faculty encourages us to be involved. They try to tailor events around our work schedules because most of the uh, cohort is our working professionals. Hofstra students showed their support of National Public Health Week in a variety of ways, including messages and health statistics scrawled in chalk on the sidewalks and on signs posted across campus. The Rethink Your Drink campaign in the Student Center illustrated the surprising sugar content of popular beverages while the beer goggles demonstration showed students just how disorienting alcohol can be to the system. The National Public Health Week is really an initiative to um, get everyone involved in what public health is. And public health is really about not just students in public health and not just healthcare professionals, but everyone. And public health is really everything around us. So we're trying to kind of promote that idea. Um, National Public Health Week is usually um, the first week of April every year, and it's been a tradition, so we're trying to bring that to Hofstra. As a first year student, I really didn't think that we would be able to get as much done as we did, especially since the MPH program is brand new. And really the faculty here and even the department have really given us the um, power um, to be able to really put together what we envisioned um, and we're able to take what we're learning in class and actually implement them outside of the classroom, which has been very exciting for us. Right here we have um, a display with a half taxi cab and a half police car, and it says, uh, you choose your ride, don't drink and drive. Um, I think it, it gives a powerful message, really, about um, the choices that we can make and how safety is a public health issue, along with uh, physical wellness and mental wellness. Students really got moving in the free Zumba class over in the Mac Fitness Center. Today we're doing a Zumba event for all students. It's open to everybody at Hofstra and we're hoping to um, promote some nutrition and exercise along with the whole National Public Health idea. To find out more about the Master of Public Health program or the new School of Health Sciences and Human Services, go to hofstra.edu slash hshs.